Hybrid cars are vehicles that use two or more sources of energy to move. The name hybrid comes from the fact that the car uses multiple energy sources, because I believe hybrid means like two or more or something like that. Um, how do hybrid cars work? As I stated before, hybrid cars use two sources of power, which are electricity and gas. Uh, while driving through small areas such as residential and neighborhoods and urban areas, hybrid cars use their electric power supply. While driving on highways and other places that demand a faster speed than smaller areas, the gas motor kicks in. Now I'll talk about uh, materials used to uh, to make hybrid cars. First off, in the um, the construction of the battery components, you use nickel metal hydride, which is one of the most important uh, materials needed because it kind of like powers the car. <laughs> um, Something else that's used is plastic, which I don't see why they use plastic in them because hybrid cars are supposed to be good for the environment and plastic isn't, so that's weird. The plastic's used in the body of the car and the interior components. Uh, glass is used in windows, obviously. Uh, there's rubber used in things like, like uh, tires, gaskets, and timing belts. Uh, metals are used in the body of the car and things such as engines and other things inside the car, like under the hood. Um, Steel is often used for the frame, and mixed alloys are used for the exterior to maintain strength to help the car like withstand like crashes and stuff. Um, I can There's not really a like a set setting for cars, hybrid cars, because like you can use them pretty much anywhere, like anywhere you can use another car that's not a hybrid car, like just gas only. So uh, yeah, I couldn't find the average building cost of hybrid cars. I I found some information on like. Um, Yahoo Answers, but that wasn't really reliable, so I didn't use any like information for that. Battery cost is reportedly around $3,000, and you don't have to replace it very often, but um, yeah, it's around $3,000 $3, for battery replacement. But the more hybrid cars that are sold, the more suppliers of batteries will pop up, which will ultimately ca uh, cause the price to drop a bit. Um, now I'm going to talk about the cost of a few different models of hybrid cars. I was searching the Toyota website for Prius prices. I, from what I saw, there were four different models of Priuses. There was the two, the Model Two, which started at twenty-two thousand eight hundred dollars. There was the three, which started at twenty-three thousand eight hundred dollars. The four that started at twenty-six thousand six hundred dollars, and the five that started at twenty-eight thousand and seventy dollars. Now here I will show some side-by-side -side comparisons of some hybrid pickup trucks which I found on, I believe, Chevy.com, or Chevrolet.com, and GMC.com. So you can just look at these. It shows the prices of, like, I have the picture of the Silverado and the Sierra, and it shows the price of the normal one and the price of the hybrid one. So you just look at those. Okay, now that you've seen the prices of certain hybrid cars, I'm going to show you a short video clip talking about the um, the batteries for hybrid cars. So here it is. On websites such as thehybridexperience.com, where people have driven their hybrids for 250 to 300,000 miles on the original battery. Now, in certain cases, Toyota's actually bought those vehicles back from the owners to tear them apart and see how they held up. Now, what they found is on those nickel metal hydride batteries that they were holding a charge almost like the day they were brand new. Now, what most people don't know is there's actually a second battery on Toyota hybrids. It's just similar to your normal car where you have a 12-volt battery, and its main job is not to drive the car, but it's actually to just run your accessory systems, such as your stereo, your power windows, and your power door locks. Okay, now that we've talked about what hybrid cars are, the type of energy they use, how they work, the materials used to make them, the cost of the batteries, and the cost of the cars themselves, now it's time to talk about the pros and the cons of using hybrid cars. Uh, we'll start with the pros. They are environment friendly. Using these cars reduces the damage caused to the environment by emission of greenhouse gases such as carbon dioxide. They have better mileage. You get more miles to the gallon while using hybrid cars. There's efficient performance. Hybrid cars are known to be better performers than gas only cars. In the US you get tax benefits when buying hybrid cars. And in some countries, you even get special roads which are meant only for these hybrid cars. So hybrid users get their own special roads, which is pretty cool. Um, now we'll talk about the cons. Uh, hybrid cars are costly due to the fact that they have uh, two different engines. Although the price of these cars is so high, the price is justified as they help save the envir environment. 
and the price would be covered up in the long run like with gas savings and stuff like that I don't really know um, there's low resale value although hybrids are quite costly to buy the resale value is pretty low so yeah the use of batteries is risky critics argue that the the use of costly high voltage batteries in cars can turn out to be disastrous especially in the case of an accident uh, manufacturers combat this argument with by saying that the batteries are designed to turn off in case of an accident. Okay, now we've got to talk about my opinion on hybrid cars. Uh, I think that hybrid cars would be worth the money that it costs to buy them because they do help lower, help to lower the greenhouse gas emissions into the atmosphere. They're so they're good for the environment, I guess. Well, better for the environment than other cars, and you can save a lot on gas, which is something that's always good because we all know how expensive gas can be. So. That's my opinion. Now, test questions. Uh, number one, what two power sources do hybrid cars use? Number two, when is each source of power used while driving a hybrid car? And number three, name two of the five main materials used in hybrid cars.